Guys, this is a high brass shot shell, and this Winchester AA right here is a low brass shot shell. And believe it or not, the low brass on the left is probably one of the most popular in the United States to reload. Now guys, there's been a lot of misinformation here on YouTube saying that high brass shells are the only ones you can use to reload, or that low brass shells are somehow inferior to their high brass equivalents. When in reality, the high brass is really just a carryover from the paper shot shell days, where it was used to prevent the initial igniting powder charge from actually burning pinholes through the outside of the paper tube. Now let's say hypothetically you don't believe me. Looking at my shot shell reloading manual here, you can see four popular target cases are all low brass. And here in another section, as long as the internal geometry is the same, the outside brass height makes no difference. So if you're reloading a modern quality hull, just understand that the internal hull geometry will make way more of a difference than the brass height on the outside. If you guys would like me to explain more of the differences in a part two, drop me a comment and let me know what you'd like to see explained.